Ableton Live 12.3 has just baked Splice directly into Live's browser. This means instant previews that are in sync with your track. And the best part, it even works with the free Splice plan. So if you've spent hours looking for the perfect sample, switching between Splice and your DAW, you'll know how important this update is. Okay, so let's jump into Live and see this in action. So here is Splice directly in Live's browser. We just simply go down to the Splice button here and it appears, sign into your account and you're good to go. Now you can search for instruments, genres, cinematic effects, or search with sound. If we choose instruments here, we can go down, find say a synth, let's view all. Just like Splice, we can search by key. So if I go C minor, I said the best bit is I can press play in my session and preview the samples before I drag it in. Check this out. So I press play here. And choose a sample. If you see here, that's not affecting my credits. And as soon as I drag it in, that's where it would spend the credit. It takes some time to download, then it's directly in your project. Let's hear that. Let's bring in a few more loops. Yeah. So look there, I've just dragged in a bunch of loops. A song is happening really quickly. Check this out. So good. Having that preview feature directly inside the door and everything being sync, that's going to speed up your workflow massively and solve one of the biggest workflow headaches ever in music production, which is choosing the right sample. Now we have this really cool option here, which is search with sound. So I can choose one of these sounds, say for example, this drum kit here, I can drag it in and it's automatically going to look for samples that are similar, which solves another one of those workflow headaches, which is not knowing what to do next or what fits with each other. Now we have a bunch of stuff that's going to work and I can filter it down here. So I can go just drums, please. So British of me, I can search genres. So if I go house, let's choose that. Let's have a little listen. That's cool. That's cool. That's really good. Let's drag that one in. Okay. So samples that I didn't even think I needed, I needed. <laughs> okay. And you can do this also with your acapella as well. So if you're unsure of your acapella, we can, we can create a section of it. Command E, drag it in. That's going to analyze the key and the tempo and BPM and try and find some loops for you. But is it perfect? Let's find out. So what we got here. Solo it up. No. It's not getting the key quite right. I mean, I'm not giving it too much harmonic information to play on, but things are heading in the right direction. Like I said, is it perfect? No, but it's fun to play with, sure. And like I said, this works with the free Splice accounts. So you've got over 2000 brand new samples directly in Live's browser, all in sync, ready to drag in wherever you would like. So yeah, Ableton didn't just integrate Splice into Live's browser, it fixes one of the most annoying things about modern music, which is sample selection. It happens in real time, doesn't stop your flow, keeps the music going. And if Ableton Live is still feeling like a bit of a headache, you're not really enjoying it, can't get your head around it, I have a full Ableton Live course, it takes you step by step through all the features using my unique Play Create Master system. More on that below. Anyway, I've been Craig. Bye for now. See you in the next one.